Hi guys, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody's doing well. This is Monday morning in Eflin, North Carolina. That's right, you heard me say Eflin. I am on a large sheetrock repair job. And guess where I found these people, or they found me? Sitting in my driveway on the farm with that van, and she, a lady just drove up beside me and says, can you do sheetrock work? And I said, of course I can do sheetrock work. And she says, well, follow me right up the road, which is exactly one half mile in this nice neighborhood tucked off in the, a side road here. I've never been up in here. But anyway, I came over, followed her over here, and, and this is what I ran into. They had a contractor come in here, a guy who volunteered his services and said, oh, don't worry, I'll help you remodel your kitchen. Well, and of course I got a new friend, right? I got a new friend. That's right, that's the neighbor's dog. Been hanging with me all morning. Everywhere I go, she goes. Right, everywhere I go, you go. That's right. Okay. Now, here's the job. They completely gutted the existing wall. There was a wall across here. They took that out. And of course, you can see the mess in the ceiling. And this is a modular, so there's your split between the two halves. Yep. Yeah. And there you go. I gotta rebuild everything and create a new new design in here. So it's not gonna be like the original. Plus I've got to rebuild the kitchen and extend the cabinet, the, the countertop, excuse me, across, rebuild this wall right here, and uh, you can see the just the amount of sheetrock work that I'm going to have to do here, mud work, and a lot of alterations, because i got to put a door over there, and there's no frame, no stud system, nothing, so I've got to build all that, basically. What are you doing in the house? See, I told you, she follows me everywhere. I mean, just literally since I've been here this morning, it won't leave my side. Okay. All right. Come on, doggy. Come on, you can't be in the house. Come on. Come on, girl. She listens. She listens real well. Come on. There you go. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Come on, let's go out in the yard. Anyway, here we go. Sitting in my driveway in Eflin, North Carolina, and I get approached and asked if I could do sheetrock work and this is turning into about a four to five day job and uh, anyway I just wanted to give you that heads up about advertising because uh, you know I never advertise and the only advertisement I have is that that van with that name on it and that's how the business comes to me only because the name is simplistic and people understand what it means and it draws you it draws them to me because of the name so I'm lucky in that regard uh, that I created the name Mr. Fixall and it served me well. And you can see I got just about everything pulled out. Still got a bunch of stuff in the van uh, that I got to go through to get all my specialty tools. And we're going to get this place squared away. All right, guys, you know what to do. Hit the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, leave those comments, and I'll see you guys on another video. Tom, I'm out of here. And, oh, by the way. Let me share something with you about this experience I uh, did yesterday with the horse farm. It was an invitation. I am not a horse fan. Let me just make that very clear. I'm not a fan of horses. But I wanted to go look at this farm. And the farm was incredible. It was too big. It was humongous. 500 acres of just gorgeous, pristine land. And being that I was invited off of YouTube to go up there and take a look at it, I, I did. I enjoyed myself, but it's not me. I'm just being honest with you, it's not me. Uh, the next place I'm going to go is visit a cattle farmer, and uh, then I'm going to visit a pig farmer, a chicken farmer, and, and get their take on what animals are going to be the best for my place. So that's what I'm doing is I'm doing research. And, and I want you guys to know that. I'm just not out running around the country trying, hanging out at expensive, uh, you know, equestrian parties uh, by, and, and sipping tea. Uh, that's not me, okay? But the bottom line is I still wanted to go. I wanted to check the layout, see the infrastructure, see how it was all done. And the place is gorgeous. There was, I got a lot of tips 
uh, from it, but it's not anything that I'm going to probably relate to my property or to the land. Okay, just wanted to give you that update. All right, thanks, guys. See you guys on another video. Bye. How does work find you?